it because something very special is happening today. The sun is shining. <laughs> it's the 13th of February and the last few weeks have just been so cold and grey and a bit rainy and, <laughs> and now today it's 13 degrees outside. That's so warm. I really want to get outside. I need to ship some orders so I'm going to walk to the post office. I want to buy some bananas because I want to make banana bread and then um, hopefully I'm going to be able to sit down at the park and sketch a bit because I started a new sketchbook. I just really want to get outside today because it's so pretty outside. But before I leave, I want to show you something. I ordered a stick and mule for the first time ever and I haven't had a look inside yet, so it's a surprise for me too. I ordered their sample pack and also some magnet samples because I really want to sell magnets again. But the manufacturer that I used in the past just was very unreliable and I didn't want to <laughs> work with them. So exciting. <laughs> the magnets that I ordered are perfect. They look like this and these are probably not going to be available in my shop, but I ordered them because I really love this painting and I want to keep them for myself or just give them away to friends. The battery of my camera just died, so I had to switch to my phone, but luckily I got the new iPhone and the camera quality is just great, so I hope you don't see as much of a difference. I also got the sample pack from Sticker Mule because I wanted to have a look at their stickers because I eventually would like to try getting my stickers printed, not all of them, but some of them because effects like this one um, I'm not able to recreate at home. <laughs> the sun has gone down now, it's almost dark and I just finished my sketch and I'm very happy with it because actually most of the times when I sketch in public nothing really comes out of it so I'm very happy with that one and now I'm going to make my way to the supermarket and then home because I'm quite hungry. <laughs> I'm on my break from work now. I went into the office this morning. My neighbors are loud. I have about two hours, which is great. <laughs> but I had quite a rough night, so I want to go and get myself a cup of coffee and hopefully I will feel better in a bit. I was attacked by spiders tonight in my dream. <laughs> but that's why I didn't really sleep well. So yeah, let's go get coffee. It's Saturday today. I skipped a few days because I traveled home to my parents, as you can see, because I had to go to the doctors here because I need a few or a lot of vaccinations because I will be going to Bali in a few weeks. I want to paint today. I spent the whole morning searching for a reference photo that I like. This always takes ages, but I think I settled on this one or this one. I brought one of the wood panels with me and before I can start painting with watercolors in there I need to prime it with this watercolor primer. This is pretty small and I was hoping to get it finished this weekend. 
But I spent like two hours searching for reference photos, so these two hours are already gone. But I guess I'm going to start now. As you can see, I'm back in Cologne at home, but only for a few days because in four days I'm actually getting my next vaccine. So I'm going back home in three days, <laughs> um, but I have to go into the office, so that's why I'm here again. I still need to unpack my bags, but I wanted to show you the painting and how far I came today. It's not finished yet, but almost, and it currently looks like this. I am so, so happy about it. I didn't expect this to turn out this beautiful, <laughs> but I really, really love it. Painting on these wood panels just, I don't know, it's just a different feeling and I really, really like it. I hope my dishwasher is not too loud and you can understand me, but I wanted to unbox this package with you. Nothing really exciting, but opening packages is always fun. Yay, it's actually the right color. So this is the paper that I use for my help my notebook. I always get it in 160 grams and 120 grams. The color description of these is just so weird. Like in some online shops they are called like sand or cream, in some they're called ivory, and I never know which one to get, and I just get some of them and it's always the right color. So I guess it has multiple names, but I'm glad I got the right color because I wasn't really sure this time. Now I can make notebooks again. And now onto the most exciting package I've received in a while. <laughs> it's not anything art related, but it's something I'm very, very excited about. So it's a package from Mr. Spex. I got new glasses very spontaneously when I went on a shopping trip with my mom. I saw these glasses and I spontaneously got them and they got delivered to my home. You might be able to see there from Longchamp. I don't speak French, I don't know how to pronounce that, but they are so pretty. This is what they look like and I think they look so cool. <laughs> I am not having the best day today. I did wake up in a pretty good mood because I was so excited for my new glasses. But as you can see, I'm not wearing them right now because after a few hours, they gave me such a bad headache um, that I'm just now recovering from it and it's like 7 or 8 p.m. Just none of my plans really worked out today, which is why I'm kind of sad. To make myself feel better, I want to do something that I have been putting off for a while now, which is taking care of my Plans. I kind of neglected them over the past few months because work, art, friends, family, that's just a lot and I don't know, it just doesn't fit into my time anymore as well as it did a few years ago. So some of them are dying and I would love to just go to the garden center and get new ones, make myself feel better. But since I'm going to go to Bali for almost a month in a few weeks, 
it just doesn't make sense to buy new plants now because some of them are probably going to die when I'm away. But yeah, I really want to take care of this one right here. It's a philodendron plumani and it has never really been doing very well. I have it in pawn. I think I'm just gonna cut it off and propagate it and then maybe plant it into normal or coconut soil because it just didn't work out for it and I'm gonna try something new and I hope it will survive the propagation process. I already did the same thing with my philodendron marmine and it currently looks like this. <laughs> It's lost all of its leaves because it also had thrips. This one has thrips as well. Almost all of my plants have thrips. But yeah, there's one new leaf coming, so I hope it will just grow roots and then unfold a new leaf and everything will be fine again. <laughs> and then I just want to clean because my apartment is very dusty and I think it will make me feel a lot better when it's not as dusty and dirty anymore. Let's go. That's the only green leaf this plant has left, but I hope this will stay for a while. This is what the roots look like, so they also show that this plant hasn't really been doing well. This is already making me so much happier. I love how the single leaf looks like a heart. Yeah, I think it looks cute, even though it only has one leaf, but I hope it will get better now. Little update, I stopped filming for the vlog because I caught COVID again and I was sick for like two weeks. So I'm leaving for Bali on Friday. <laughs> so prepare for lots of cool Bali vacation content. I'm really planning on vlogging there because I want to like document the vacation for myself as well. Update on the plants. This is the plant that I just repotted in the last clip. Um, it's lost its pretty hard leaf. Yeah, we'll see how it looks like after the vacation, if it's dead or if it has a new leaf. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in Bali.